In the final part of our series on mom and pop shops who are going digital, tonight we meet a jeweler who is taking her traditional business into the 21st century. Sharon Epperson has her story. Fourth generation jeweler Miriam Gamushian still makes jewelry the way it's been done for centuries, by hand. Our business is incredibly old fashioned. But our company and the industry has come a long way from doing business the old fashioned way. Before, things didn't happen so fast. Before, you didn't have the luxury of speed. So if a customer in California wanted to see something, it could take up to two weeks for them to actually get the piece then show it to the customer, and then, um, you know, by the time the whole business was done from A to Z, it could be a month. Today, I can do that in 24 hours. Gamushin says speed is key because consumers want instant gratification, and now clients from all over the world can see her pieces immediately through social media. A woman can relate when you see a picture of a ring on, on a finger or, or a necklace or an earring, and. This is something that we are very, you know, we like to show how it's worn. In real time, we snap pictures. And so when women do see that and they want to try it on, it's, it's, it's a lifestyle. Social media is the best thing that ever happened to small business because it used to be you had to get through these gatekeepers to get to people. Now, if somebody's on social media, you can get to them. But the thing about it is, is it's all about your Google ability of your business and your brand. Gamushian knows her brand well. High-end jewelry designed by women for women, and she targets her audience where they spend much of their time, on Instagram. I was so surprised that women, literally, I would say definitely my age and up, had checked me out. So they knew all about me, they knew the name of my collections, they knew some of the stories, they knew where I had appeared, and I was like, wow, I mean, you know, these women really did their homework, and I'm like, how'd you know about it? Because, well, I checked you out. Experts say there may be no need for small business owners to use several types of social media. Use one social media site well. You don't need to be doing Facebook, Pinterest, Google+, Facebook, all at the same time. You need to be doing one well, and it should be the one where your best target customer is spending the majority of their time online. Still, even keeping it simple can become overwhelming as business grows. The thing with, with technology, even though it's easy in a way, I think you do work much, much more because you're able to reach so many more people within the day, within the same day. But there is one important uh, factor that Gamushin says makes juggling it all fantastic. manageable. I love it. Mwah. I love what I do. I'm passionate about my industry. And, and all our babies that we create. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Sharon Epperson. That's my dream job, work with jewelry. Work with jewelry. Yeah, she has beautiful stuff. She has beautiful items, absolutely.